Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is part makeup tutorial, part vlog. So I'm going to a, it's called Bacon Eggs and Kegs. It's like a brunch festival. So I'm going later today and I thought you t I'd take you guys along with me in this video. So as you can see, I'm priming my eyelids with my Urban Decay priming potion. And then I'm gonna take my Morphe palette and just put this nice soft brown shade in my crease. This is my go-to makeup look. I do this look all the time, so I'm just flying through it. And then grabbing that same palette, I'm gonna pick up, it's like this pink shimmer shade, and I'm just patting that all over my lids. And then from there, you'll see me grab my Melt Cosmetics palette, and I take this red shade, and this kind of like deep purple pink shade, and I pack that in the corner of my lids as well. It's kind of like a sunset eye that I'm going for here. And I'll put everything down in the description so you'll know what brushes I used, what palette colors, all the things. So I did my lashes off camera, but I used my NYX liquid liner to line them, and then I'm just wearing my Lily Lashes in the style Miami. So right now for my skin, I'm putting powder all over my face. This is the Laura Mercier powder, and then I'm taking my Armani foundation, and I'm just dotting that all over my face, and I'm gonna brush it out with a Morphe M439 brush. And then using the same Morphe brush, I'm just gonna take my Armani concealer and put that all over the areas of my face that I wanna highlight. And then I'm just gonna blend that out as well. And then using another Morphe brush, I'm just gonna take that same Laura Mercier powder and pat the areas of my face that I hit with concealer so I can just set it in place so it'll stay matte and I won't get super oily. And then I'm gonna grab my Vanity Planet brush and my Bare Minerals powder in the shade, I believe it's in the shade Hazelnut, even though they discontinued it, so it's probably in the shade Mocha. And I'm gonna go ahead and put that all over my face. And then to bronze up my cheeks, I'm going to grab my Anastasia Beverly Hills Cream Bronzer, and I'm gonna use the brush that goes along with it. I'm gonna put that down below, and then I'm just gonna um, add some, some dimension to my cheeks, contour it up a bit. Usually I'll do like a cream contour and then a powder bronzer, but this time around I just wanted to just keep it really minimal, I guess you could say, and just go with cream. For my blush, I decided to use the Patrick Ta blush in the shade She's Blushing, and I'm using that on a Sonia Kashuk brush. I really like this shade. It's really, really light pink. It, do, it does really look like someone is just blushing, and it's just like a light wash of pink over their cheeks. And then for my brows, I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Pills Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Dark Brown to fill them in. I'm really enjoying doing this towards the end of my makeup routine. It's usually one of the first things I do, but because it kept getting mixed in with my foundation, I pushed it back a little further um, during my routine and I'm enjoying it. So to finish up my eyes, I'm just taking the two shades I put in my outer corner and lining them down on my lower lid using a Morphe. This is one of their smudger brushes. And I'm just gonna take that and just smudge it all the way on my lower lash line. And then I picked up another Morphe brush, I believe, and I just put like this really light beige shade in my inner corner to kind of brighten it up a bit. And then I finished things off by taking my Maybelline mascara and Melt Cosmetics gel liner and putting that in my lower lash line. And then for my lip gloss, I'm using the new Fenty Beauty lip gloss. I think it's in the shade Riri. And I put that all over my lips and then set my face with my Patrick Star setting spray. So that's it, let's get to this vlog. On our way to the bus stop because we are not driving downtown. to eat all of the bacon, egg, and keg themed dishes. <laughs> may or may not have taken a shot before we came.
So we're home now. I'm changed. I put on my little Beyonce shirt. Um, I'm gonna keep filming though because I have a couple other videos that I want to film in advance. But it was really fun. It was from 11 to 3 and they do it. I've heard about this event before. It's called Bacon, Eggs and Kegs and they've done it here in Seattle. They also do it in Nashville. I think it's a newer event because it's not nationwide i don't think not at least not according to the website but we had a really great time there was music all sorts of different food options they had merchandise as well but i didn't need anything with like bacon egg and cheese little cartoons on it i don't that would that would become a workout t-shirt if anything i'm not gonna wear that out and about but i went with my mom and a longtime friend of mine and we had a good time we tried so many things drank so it was really cool.